Get Out Run. All right, the new single from Lip Switch. An awesome song, and you should pick it up. It's uh, at lipswitch.com. Anyways, it um, starts off. Anyways, that is the uh, 11th fret G string. And to the uh, 10th fret um, G string. To the 9th fret G string. And then it goes on the D string. It hits the 9th fret. And then, so, so that's the first part. And now we're working on the part where it goes like this. And that's on the D string. And that is 9, 12, 9 on the D string. And then it does the first part again. And then it's, this time it goes, it goes, wait. Yeah, and then it goes uh, 12 on the D string, and then 9 on the G string, and then 9 on the um, D string. And then it goes into the verse, which is the 7th fret um, on the e, e string, which is B, and um, that's the key of the song, B. So it goes... So it goes down, click, up, down, click, is what I would do. Down, click, up, down, click, up, down, click. And that's up, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. Up, down. I do a hammer on there, it's hard to explain. But anyways, um... That's on the um, seventh fret A string to the uh, eighth fret A string. So it's so wait. So whenever I do the pull off or hammer on, I don't strum it. Okay, slow motion. When I went like that, I pulled it. I didn't hit the string. It looked like it though. That's why I said that. And then it goes in back into the, and right before he sings, he goes, there it is. And that is down, up, down, uh, down, up, down, down. And that is um, on the seventh fret uh, E string to the seventh fret A string. Two there, one there on the A, two there on the E string, two there on the A, one there on the A string, one there on the E string. So. So, wait. And then, back into that. But instead of, it just it cuts that off because it's short. Down. Um, eight, nine, 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 eight, eight, eight. And so it hits it. One, and then up, down. the verse so then it goes um, eight seven eight seven on the a string then it goes three 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 on the e string and then five five this is if you're playing this in drop D tuning, I just realized. Because I know that on this song, he tuned it. But if you're playing these lip switch songs and you learn all these other songs, this is all in, uh, not just drop D tuning, but in D tuning. So every string is a whole step lower. So the this E string is actually playing a D note. A is playing a G. I have to think about this too. And then D is playing a C. And then G is playing an F. So it's a whole step lower. And so, so I, like I'm a, I, I just realized that um, that um, they actually played this song in normal tuning, but if you learned all these songs, and and you don't want to switch bases, you know that sort of thing, this is how, where you'd play it, all right? Because this is the only song that's like that, and so if you leave it in the tuning of the other songs, this is where it's at, okay? If you tune it up to normal tuning, everything I'm doing. That would make it a higher, two higher, so you'd have to make everything two notes lower, you know, to compensate. But that's neither here nor there. Okay, so, anyways, it goes to the chorus. So I did the chorus. Um, one, so a fifth fret E. One, two, three, four, one, one, two, three, 
four, just quarter notes. I mean, you could do that, but I th I just think it's that, just quarter notes, like one, two, three, four, on the G, the chorus. Uh, get up, get out, don't turn around, run. Get up, get out, don't turn around, run. And that is, um, so it's going from the three on the E to the five, and then it goes to the seven on the um, fifth string. So, so it hits it twice, and it goes five, seven on the A string, five, seven. And then seven again, five, seven, seven, seven. And then it goes eight, eight, seven. And then it does the chorus again. A third time. Get up, get out, to turn around. Run. And it doesn't do that, it skips right to and that's eight, seven, eight, seven on the A string. Back into the verse. Which is like funky James Bond. This man has a James Bond theme running through it a little bit. And so, you know, there's chromatic notes. And uh, this is, it has that sound. Yeah, with that. Oh yeah, and so anyways, it does uh, the um, chorus again, it does the verse again, does the chorus, and then it does the guitar solo. So at the end of the, at the end of the chorus w that we just did, when it goes, right? Uh, and, and then instead of going to the verse, for the second verse, after the second, because that's after the first chorus, after the second chorus, it goes to the solo, so it goes, and that's gonna be to D, which is a fifth fret A string. So that is um, five, five, seven on the on the A string, seven on the E string, A string. So right. So five, five on the A string, seven on the E string, five, five on the A string, seven. Slide off for a, you know two, three, four back. And then it does this, five, seven on the E string, five on the A string, five on the D string, seven on the E, and it sounds like this. And then it does the, it again. It's like, three, four. And that's, you know, same thing. And then it goes, but this time when it goes like this, it's a little different. It does it. Even more James Bonnie, you know. Because that's like totally. Uh, anyways, so um, I really like bands that do that though. The jazz, chromatic, and minor key. That's kind of like. One of my very favorite things, that's what I like about Lip Switch is this sort of thing, is they're one of the bands, I used to look for bands that did that, because uh, Bang Tango did that, and uh, Guns N' Roses would do it a little bit, and Dawkins would do it a little bit, and has like these darker sort of classical jazz tones that I like, which ends up being in my head the James Bond theme, you know, classical jazz orchestra. And anyways, um, so it does that, and then, it, so that's this. So that is... Um, <clears throat> um, oh, <clears throat> I was eating peanuts. <clears throat> okay, 11 to, to 9. So 11 on the G, 9 on the D. Twice. And then it, this goes, this stays on the 9, but this goes from the 11 to the 10. And there's your chromatic. Chr chromatic means every note in a row. You know? Common jazz thing. Then... So now I'm using one finger to go do the, both nines on the G and the D. So G, D, G, D. And then it goes, stays here and it goes one, two, three, four, just on the root note of the song, which is the B note. And that is the ninth fret of the D string. One, two, three, four, or down, up, down, up. Then it does it again. A third time. And the fourth time. Then he goes. 
And that is 8787 on the A to the chorus. In any ways. And then it does the end of the song where it goes. Back to that. The verse, you know. Get out. Get out, run. Get out, run. And that's the end of the song. And there you go.